Good morning. Thanks for joining us for Local 3 News. I'm Rebecca Bartlemay and joining me this morning is Sheriff Greg Zyber from the Marquette County Sheriff's Office. Thanks for coming in. Good morning. Thank you. Yeah, and so we've been talking about ways people can be safe and last hour we talked about staying safe in uh, winter weather conditions, but now we are going into the Smart 911 and what is that? This is something that the Marquette County adapted and it's a, it's a great uh, thing for people who may have elderly or handicap or anything. There's what it is is it sets up a profile and you fill out the information and give it to central dispatch so if ever you call 911 they have all this information at their fingertips it can be anything from I have three Rottweiler or dogs that may attack you you know so be aware of the dogs or what door I want you to come in or I have uh, diabetes and or a list of the medications you can get fill it out and give it to central dispatch they enter it in so when nine when you call 911 from your residence all this information that you give them is right at their fingertips because time of is of the F essence when you dial 911 Definitely. And so uh, how long has this been implemented here? I believe it's been a little over a year and a half, two years. And it's a, it's a great tool. You can contact uh, Central Dispatch, specifically Gary Johnson at 475-1196. Or you can go to smart91.com um, and set it up online. All right. And so, you know, we used um, some examples of people who might want to use this. And so um, as have people... Um, you know, here have they been able to use it and been able to see what you know, conditions people have before they, you know, go into a situation? Absolutely. As I said, time is, is of the essence. When a police officer or when that call comes into central dispatch, the dispatcher can already advise the officer who's showing up instead of knocking on the door, knowing the back door is open, they can go in the back door. Or So time is really what it, it helps the officer or the first responder who's going to the scene. It could be fire, ambulance, police, it, uh, Central Dispatch gives all that information to them. All right, yeah, and I'm sure, um, what have you kind of heard from Central or from responders when they've gone out in these situations and ha have had this information ahead of time? Well, as a police officer, and I, I know the more information I have, the better it is for that situation. Great, well, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. Yeah, and for more information, you can check out our website, upmatters.com, and tune to Local 3 News tonight at 6 o'clock, 5 o'clock Central for more local news, weather, and sports.